How you doing, YouTubers? As you can see, I've gone back to the dark side. The internal combustion engine is still here, and it still works, as opposed to the uh, the last time we spoke uh, regarding the lithium-ion uh, modern motor that we were using. Uh, let me give you, uh, in summary, what my experience has been after a year's worth of uh, use, a year and a few months. Uh, and and the, the bottom line is that it was, it was a great concept. The design, I think, was lacking in terms of its reliability and its serviceability. Uh, some of the folks on the channel have been complaining about the units uh, not working or working erratically or just stopping and not being able to turn them on again. So that's the same problem that I had, and I uh, we tried to address it with the uh, uh, higher tier technical support for MTD. Uh, they had me going to a local repair shop that was an authorized service center. Uh, and essentially, after about three months worth of work, they weren't able to repair it. So we parted company, I guess, in good terms in the sense that they returned my money, they refunded my money. Uh, at this point, I can't quite recommend the, the um, the unit after about, as I said, about a year's worth of uh, usage. So, uh, unfortunately, because of the laws that are changing in this country, I think most companies are going to have to come out, at least on the consumer end, with a, uh, an electric-powered uh, 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 mower. But I don't know exactly when that's supposed to happen, or uh, one of the things that I would obviously advise folks that are watching this is that they have to look at the repairability, who's going to repair it, and whether or not they have a good warranty. In the case of MTD, they offered a three-year warranty, which I'm grateful they had because I was able to use it. Anyway, best of luck. Comments, comment as you as you uh, as you wish. Thanks.